All right, guys, wanted to talk real quickly about a just a small change in my, um, I guess my mindset or my verbiage that I'm using um, dealing with listing. I think all of us um, can agree that listing is probably one of the more challenging things to deal with in terms of uh, an eBay business and, you know, when there's a bottleneck, it, it's usually there somewhere around listing, uh, getting your items up and things like that. It's never it's never thrifting, I mean, or sourcing. You know, sourcing is probably one of the more fun things to do uh, in this. Uh, one of the, the, the best tasks or the more fun tasks to do in the business is to go out and, and uh, treasure hunt and find items and all those good things. Um, but even more important than that, you know, you can thrift all day long and source all day long. And some of us do source all day long and then end up and this is a problem that I'm having so don't, don't think that I'm trying to you know um, I guess nitpick or, or poke, poke fingers at anybody but uh, what it is is um, you know we, ha we have these things called uh, death piles right we have items that we've purchased we know they're valuable we want to um, you know profit from them but yet we haven't gotten around to getting them up on the website. And so they're just sitting there in a pile. And I heard this on Instagram somewhere, but, um, and, and I'm sorry, I'm not giving credit to the person who came up with it, but um, she, what she did was she kind of just changed, tweaked the word from death pile, she calls it a money pile. And for whatever reason, that to me is, is just so powerful and so profound because, you know, when you think of it as a death pile, you think of it as, oh man, I gotta do something with this death pile. But when you think about a money pile, it's kind of like, oh, I can't wait to attack that money pile and get some of that money out of that pile. So uh, <laughs> um, as silly as that sounds and as small a detail as that might sound like, um, it's making me feel like I need to go um, go attack that money pile. And I need to go, um, you know, I guess, uh, get all those profits out of that money pile because it's just sitting there waiting for me to get those items up get them listed and I know as soon as I list a few a few are gonna sell you know it's not gonna be probably the same items sometimes it is sometimes it's not but um, something about listing items um, helps to I guess stir the pot get, keep things moving and, and gets um, gets items sold and so I could use that you know I could definitely use some um, some eBay sales get you know get my sales up and um, you know start digging into that money pile so I just thought it was a cool change of words um, I don't know uh, what people think about it or, or um, you know may maybe you prefer maybe you're negatively motivated and you prefer the idea of a death pile because um, for whatever reason but for me personally I just love the idea of a money pile because it makes me want to it just makes me want to engage with it it makes me want to get that money out of there and, and and get the value or, or get the, gain the profit. So I just wanted to kind of touch base on that real quick. I don't know if uh, anyone else uh, likes that term, but you know, I'm not taking credit for it. Someone else came up with it. I saw it on uh, Instagram, but I just think it's a great uh, change of, of verbiage that'll help us, you know, maybe keep our mind on the prize or, or I, definitely it's working for me, keeping my mind on the fact that that pile has money in it. There's money sitting right there. And for me to, um, all I got to do is just go ahead and list some of those things and, and boom, money's going to come out. So I thought it was cool. And I'll talk to you guys soon. Have a great day. Aloha.